Hey y'all, good afternoon y'all, good afternoon. If y'all watched yesterday's vlog, you'll know why I'm like stressed out a little bit today. Not even, today is a new day, I feel good today. But I'm supposed to be in Miami. I was supposed to wake up this morning, head to Miami. I was gonna do brunch in Miami, spend the whole day, and then probably brunch again on Sunday. But unfortunately, it's 12 o'clock. I woke up on time, but I had to edit this candle haul video, which I recorded yesterday, but I gotta get it out like today. I wanted to get the candle video out today because it's the last day of the sale. So whoever is watching my video that same day, I was like, Hey y'all, today's a candle day sale. If you're watching this right now, like go online, you can shop online, you know? So now I'm gonna be leaving. Hopefully y'all, I'm still even debating right now as I'm talking to y'all if I'm still gonna go. Miami is only three hours away. That's not far at all. It's Saturday, the weather is good outside. It's just, I don't know, I just don't like when things are not working in my favor. I gotta drive to Miami, but I wanna come ready cause like I'm not checking into a hotel or anything. I'm meeting up with my friends that are there already. So obviously I cannot get ready on the highway. So it's like, I have to do my makeup now. Sorry, it's like when you do your brows, you just have to focus. Yeah, so it's like, I have to do my makeup now. My face is probably gonna still be oily by the time I actually get there. But I'm gonna bring my powder and stuff. Anyways, y'all, so I had just wanted to check in with y'all, let y'all know good afternoon, good morning, what I'm doing today. I'm gonna go to Miami. I think I need that stress relief to go. I said I was supposed to get brunch. I ended up just eating Dunkin' Donuts here in Orlando. So that saved me some money. And I got me some water. Mm. Ooh. And then too, y'all, I just don't like saying I'm gonna do something and don't do it. Like if I say I'm going to Miami, like I'm going to Miami. And then I be getting myself so geeked up, I be so excited. And then if I don't go, I'm gonna be like kinda sad. Woof. All right, y'all. This is what I'm looking like. Very much, very much rushed. Um, I decided to wear this outfit because like I said, it is the Miami Art Festival Art Basil. So it's gonna be like a lot of cool sculptures cool paintings cool artwork you know abstract and stuff so i was like let me put on this little chevron you know put me on the wall <laughs> i'm joking y'all but this is what i'm doing like i said y'all got a three hour drive so this is gonna stay on because y'all know how the baby hairs be cutting up sometimes um this has my back out which i really don't like because y'all know my rose but it's cool and yeah, this is the vibe for today. Um, I did not have intentions on staying the night. Since I'm coming to Miami so late today, I may just spend the night. The event that we're going to tonight, I think it starts at eight or 10, but I don't even know what the attire is. I seen like they had like a promo video. So people were dressed up, but I didn't see people in heels, I don't think. But I don't know, girl. I had brought heels and I brought flats. So that's that. <laughs> Y'all, and my video is exporting to YouTube. Let's see what it says now. I can leave my computer on now that it's exporting to YouTube. It says like it's two minutes left. I'll check again before I walk right out. Hopefully there's no copyright claims. I don't think there is. Y'all know I'll be checking my music because if it's a copyright claim, I'm gonna be real mad. All right, y'all, so now I'm about to go. I'm not gonna show y'all me at the bank because that's just unnecessary, but I just had wanted to show y'all what I got on. And yeah, I will probably get some B-roll of me driving to Miami and stuff. So see y'all when we touch down in Miami, in Miami. To waste time, I was just doing fine. Should I find something new or should I be tripping on you? These decisions ain't easy Believe me, I know it's hard to read me And I know these girls I'm getting greedy Cause I can't find one that knows how to treat her yeah. I'm just really trying to Who really trying to know who I am Cause right now I can't even trust my friend I'm trying to live my life right That's all I'm trying to do God damn, she going Y'all need to chill on my home girl I need to get gas, but this lady getting gas too. Hope she don't think I'm following her. <laughs> Y'all ever had to make the same turns as somebody else? I be feeling like, oh my god, they think I'm stalking them. Ooh, y'all, there's a Lagrange by the um gas 
station. I'm hungry, y'all. I am so hungry. Anyways, I don't want nobody to come up and approach me, so I'm gonna bring y'all with me. Sometimes when I have this camera in my face, sometimes people won't approach me because they be like, oh, she busy. Yes, I am. Thank you. Yes. <laughs> the newer they get, the more sleep they were. Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. Like, now, now they're like getting more modern, yep. <laughs> yeah, looking cool. Thank you. Never mind. I drive a Camaro, so. Oh, like coming from a, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Y'all, is it just me or when it says like, go see attendant, I'm like, no, no, no. I'm not going inside. I'll try a different car or I'll try like doing credit or something. Like I hate going inside. <laughs> I hate going inside. That was a fail. I was just about to say, I'm gonna bring my camera with y'all because I feel like people won't talk to me if I have my camera out. And why as soon as I get out, somebody talking to me about my car. He said he liked my car. Anyways, I was just giving y'all an update. I guess your girl will struggle on through. Next time I pick up this camera, it's gonna be when I'm at Miami, Miami. <laughs> that one, oh my gosh. Hey nigga. <laughs> like this when I'm in Miami like I haven't been here like 30 times y'all know Miami is nothing but a bop to me like I literally come down here every spring break I just met Naya at the Miami fashion district it's basically just like a bunch of stores a bunch of designer stores with like nice art artwork in between the stores we were trying to go to the Dior cafe but they had like a line and turn right I wasn't trying to eat there because like I said earlier it's a cafe they Half only have turn left on Come on, lady. I got to go. Yeah, like I said, your cafe is literally a cafe and I'm hungry. So I just dropped her back off to her Airbnb and I looked up like steakhouses near this area because I want some salmon. So I looked up this place called Fish and Something Steakhouse and the food looks really, really good. The salmon doesn't look too good, but there was a picture on Google, it was lobster and mashed potatoes and that looks freaking good so the place that we're going to starts at eight o'clock but oh this is a coyota taco i've seen that on google review we're gonna get tacos after the club there's this taco spot that's open until 5 a.m and y'all know me i'm gonna get bread tacos i was about to get it now i'm like let me not come to miami and get freaking bread tacos as soon as i get here like that's just very much very much. He gave me the cocktail menu. I was well, I asked for the cocktail menu. I was thinking of getting a margarita, but we are going out tonight. And I don't know about y'all, but as of recently, like if I drink a margarita right now, I'm not gonna feel it. I'm not gonna be drunk because by the time I drink it now and go out tonight, like three hours from now, I'm not gonna feel it. So to me, it's gonna feel like a waste. So I'm thinking of just waiting till I get to the club and then just buy the drinks at the club. But I got me salmon and mashed potatoes. It's grilled, so hopefully it's good though. I'm about to get some of this bread. Just no signal in here, y'all. Well, I should not be eating bread, but I'm so hungry. Mmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 
y'all what if this is like the movies and somebody sees me sitting here by myself and pays for my food that would make my day So y'all know I gotta show y'all the first bite. It has some white sauce on it, so let's see. Mm -hmm. It's really good. Mm -hmm. It is a little on the salty side. It's still very good. They gave me all these mashed potatoes, y'all. The vegetables. Vegetables are sweet. So. All right, y'all. I'm gonna get with y'all later. It is 6:43, and we're leaving at 7:15 ish. So. Fish on. Oh. She said casual. Casual wear. That's not casual, nay. That's bad bitch. Casual. <laughs> the sneakers. Hey, y'all. So the food was really, really. It was it actually wasn't really, really good. I'd be lying. <laughs> But the food was okay. Potatoes ain't have no flavor, but I didn't want to be picky, so I ate it because I was hungry. Now I'm at the Airbnb with my friend Naya. I didn't even get to properly introduce y'all to. Whoa, Naya. What? You look good. You gotta take some pictures in. Here. <laughs> I didn't even int properly introduce y'all to her when we were at the Miami fashion district from Boston. But if y'all seen her on my channel when she came down to Orlando, we went to Universal and stuff like that. So yeah. Yes. Which kind you got? I, mean, I know you got all the good kinds. It's from Zara. I, it was ten dollars. I was That's like, good. this smells really good. Mmm, that does. I think this is what I smelled on you. Oh. Cause it was sweet. Unless you like sweet scents. I like sweet scents. Everything to me is good. Yeah, I think we should go. Oh, it's six thirty. Yeah, maybe we should. Oh, we gotta take these shots. Throw the shots back and call the back to back to back. I'm excited. I never, I never went. Well, we did try to go to the club the one time, but it was dead when we in Orlando. Oh yeah. We did take shots. We took like a shot or two. When I tell you, I've been trying to get to everyday people party for years. Hi. Literally, I, can't wait. I know. <laughs> I've had this is my first time here, but I tell you, every time I come to Miami, y'all, I never get to explore and do things outside of South Beach. Like I've never been to downtown Miami, never been in this area, Brickell, but I've always heard of it. Wynwood, heard of it, never been. I drive through it to get to South Beach, but never been. So I'm excited for the night. We are gonna take some Casamigo shots. Mm, I changed my outfit too, y'all. Cause oh, I'm so bad body, but I got this on with some just shorts. But you look good. Something I can dance in just in case. Then I play some. Mm, 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 mm. Hey. Man, you look good, girl. This is like Kiana. What is wrong with it's you? It's kind of cute though. <laughs> It's shot o'clock. Does anyone need chaser or? Just a little bit. Kiana, say hey. Hi, everyone. So, I'm not a YouTuber, but I work in human resources for a nonprofit. So, donate or try to volunteer your time to your local nonprofit or community development organization. Do a thing where you just start in and you pull out. That way, we're not clinking and making a mess. Wow. All right, one, There's two, levels. three. Oh my Ooh, god, that's so that. cute! Can you send yes, that? Yes, Yeah, send me that. Yay! Everybody. Thank you. Everybody, anybody, anybody, scream! Ah! Ah! Okay, Thanks, squirrels in my pants. <laughs> this girl's got some serious girls. <laughs> to Miami! To Miami! I thought I could do it in one. Oh, shoot, I gotta check the Uber. Oh, seven minutes away. Okay, oh, we, we got, got some time. <laughs> Yay, I'm excited. That was like three shots. I'm glad I found these. Yeah. Oh my gosh. First of all, I've never seen Naya drunk, so this will be interesting. Me, I'm the party person, so it's shocking to me. Everybody go to break.
so much fun the event actually got shut down because i think it was just either over capacity and y'all know like the fire marshals and all that stuff they don't play that but i don't know why they just maybe you know couldn't let a few people out <laughs> but yeah the fire marshals were there and then just a whole bunch of extra cops and stuff trying to regulate stuff but that's crazy because i'm like don't they have rolling out in miami that's like three to five times more people like oh what is no what yeah it's not, oh you got the same um there's no food. filling <laughs> in the actual no. does it at least flavorful looks mm -hmm. so strength i like strength let's see if it tastes better than that sauce look because the sauce is giving watery Mm -hmm. Okay, but I don't know why the sauce goes like that. Mm. Y'all, I lied. I said the tacos were good, but they really weren't. <laughs> I don't know why I do that. I think I just be being nice. I'd be like, oh yeah, this good. Mm -hmm. But no, they weren't. We literally did a DoorDash order for pickup. It said it was ready for pickup. And we were there within like probably like five minutes of it saying that getting that notification tacos cold cheese not hot i've had burrito tacos where the cheese is like stream because it's so hot and then one of the tacos it was soggy and i literally carried the bag up right and it was soggy so i'm assuming it was like sitting in sauce or something but they can have that it was okay though. I'm hungry. I ate it. But. And y'all, I got a free vape. <laughs> there was, I think they was having like some type of advertising or something. I'm whispering because her roommate sleep. I think it's like a hookah pen. I've had a hookah pen before, but it was no nicotine, no tobacco. This one does have nicotine. It says 5% salt nicotine. Thinking this is equivalent to just smoking like regular hookah. I'm not sure. I never had a pen with nicotine but i'm assuming that's just like hookah right i'm gonna have to look it up afternoon it is 1 36 we are getting ready to go to brunch we're about to actually head out now 
Reservations are at 145. We are going to try a new restaurant. It's black owned. Y'all know me, they got shrimp and grits, catfish and grits, chicken and waffles, pancakes, french toast, all that, all that, all that. You know your girl like to eat. We'll see what we'll get into after that, but that is where we are headed. Y'all, I had to go to the mall this morning because like I said, I did not have intentions on staying Sunday, but since I came so late Saturday, I was like, let me just make the most of it while I'm here and go get brunch. So I had to go to the mall to get an outfit, like the little strip. That's what I was showing y'all earlier. Um, they have some really cute stuff out there. And it's crazy because every time I come to Miami, I just stay on South Beach. I've never actually been downtown, never been to Brickell, Wynwood. But <laughs> next time I plan an actual vacation here, like, I'm definitely going to be up in there. But shout out. I don't think I showed y'all everybody there. Check the drip. Ooh, we got Kiana all black with the tail feezy. Smith and Webster. They're filled to capacity, y'all, and their kitchen closed at 2.30, so we were like, yeah, that's a dub. So now we're at bar one. This is gonna be my, be my second time here, but the food is really good. And look, hey, we got Tasha in the talk to y'all really since this morning uh we were rushing to brunch i think i might have told y'all that we were going to a place called smith and webster black owned restaurant it's gonna be my first time trying it but they're like very popular it's very small inside they were filled to capacity when we got there at two our reservation was 145 but we got there at two so they gave our table away and they said that the kitchen closes at 2 30 for brunch and there was no more tables so it would have been like a 30 minute wait and by the time we got a table it would have been closed so we were not able to go there so then we went to bar one which is a place that i went to before if y'all have not seen my miami vlog from last year but when we went to went there last year it was a much better service i don't know maybe it's because they were newer at that time so they were making sure they were on their shit but now it's like barely any waitresses. It took forever to like get even water. Like we were there for like 20 minutes then we got water. It was just, I don't know, this experience was good this time. And this was my only, my second time going. The macaroni was still good. The macaroni was still hitting. But I don't know y'all. I used to hype them up that first time because it was just so good. But now it's giving 50-50. And I don't like restaurants that are inconsistent with their service and the quality of their food i like consistency so i don't know if i'll be going back there next time i'm in miami so after that we went to day party even though it's night y'all know it gets dark early naya's friends were down visiting at two djs that were her friends and some other friends that she knew since high school and they happened to be in miami the same time so we all linked up it was like a little vibe we got some drinks they're playing like kodak they're playing drake playing a whole bunch of mixes afro beats all types of stuff it was a vibe i would have stayed longer i have to get back on the road get back to orlando i'll get back home around maybe 11 it's 7 34 and it's like three hours and 30 minutes so yeah hopefully it's not too much traffic since it's late 
Well, it feels late, but at seven is not that late. But yeah, I'm about to head back home. I wanna say thank you guys so much for watching. Please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see y'all later.